Hi, I'm Miss Pat, and I'm a teacher with the Boone County Conservation District. And today, we are going to be talking about insects. According to scientists, there are 30 million insects that we have not yet even identified in the world. And of the 850,000 insects that we have identified, only about 1% are actually harmful. Insects play a big part in an ecosystem, either locally or globally. So what makes an insect an insect? If you see some, an organism in your backyard, how do you know that it's an insect? Well, first of all, insects are all invertebrates. That means that they do not have a backbone. They have what is called an exoskeleton. Their skeleton is on the outside of their bodies. What else makes an insect an insect? Well, they're also ectothermic or cold-blooded. It means that they can't regulate their temperature by themselves. Their temperature their body temperature is regulated by forces outside of the insect, by whatever the air temperature is. Insects have some other characteristics as well. All insects have three body parts. They have a head, a thorax, and an abdomen. If an insect doesn't have those three body parts, it is not an insect. What else makes an insect an insect? Well, they have six legs. One, two, three, four, five, six. And those legs always are attached to the thorax. So if it doesn't have six legs, it's not an insect. Insects also have two antenna. If the organism doesn't have two antennas, it's not an insect. Insects also have a special kind of vision using compound eyes. Now you have, your vision is single eye vision, but insects have compound vision. So their eyes are made up of lots of different little eyes that all work together to give the insect very, very good vision. Good vision is an adaptation that the insects have that allow it to survive. Now we've added our compound eyes to our insect here. And the last thing is wings. Now not all insects have wings, but a lot of them do. So we're going to give our insect some wings. There we go. And insects also lay eggs to reproduce. Many times they lay their eggs on a leaf. So you can look underneath a leaf and maybe you can see some insect eggs. Sometimes they're really, really tiny and so you have to look really close. But you might be able to see some insect eggs. So what kind of insects would you find in your backyard? Well, you might find a ladybug and ladybugs are actually beetles, mm -hmm. or a grasshopper, or an ant, or a cricket. You might find a dragonfly, or a butterfly, or a moth. So those are all insects you might find in your backyard. So just to review, what makes an insect? All insects are invertebrates. They do not have a backbone. They're ectothermic or cold-blooded. They have three body parts, a head, a thorax, and an abdomen. They have six legs. They have two antenna, compound eyes, and they may have wings. So I hope you've learned a little bit about insects today. And when you see one in the backyard, you can take a look at it and then maybe just let it be.